क्वेश्चन नंबर 5.3 क्वेश्चन नंबर 9 फाइंड द इक्वेशन ऑफ द मीडियन एंड एल्टीट्यूड ऑफ ट्रायंगल एबीसी थ्रू ए वेयर द वर्टिसेस आर एबीसी थ्री वर्टिसेस इज गिवन सी फर्स्ट वी वांट टू फाइंड द इक्वेशन ऑफ द मीडियन इफ द ट्रायंगल दिस इज एबीसी मींस एबीसी मींस द वर्टिसेस थ्रू ए इज द मीडियन so median means we know that that is a midpoint so we want to find out what is the midpoint of this m here a point is already given and we want to find what is the midpoint of bc then we can able to find the m value right when two point is known means we can use the two point form to find the equation of the line am next for this is the median right next we want to find out the altitude altitude means we know that the through the vertices is perpendicular here a b c first we want to find out the slope of b c the slope of b c is perpendicular to a d the slope of b c is perpendicular to a d right so we can able to find the slope of a d and a point one point and slope is known so we can use the slope point form to find the another equation let's see one by one so this is the given point and first we want to find the median median of bc so midpoint of bc is equal to median is nothing but midpoint of bc is nothing but m so m point we know the formula x1 plus x2 divided by 2 comma y1 plus y2 divided by 2 is the midpoint formula so b and c point only we have to take let me take it as c point as x1 y1 b point as x1 y1 x2 and the c point as x2 y2 now the slope of m is equal to bc is nothing but m right that x1 plus x2 is minus 5 plus 1 divided by 2 comma y1 plus y2 is minus 1 plus 9 divided by 2 now here when you substitute this we get minus 4 divided by 2 here we get 8 divided by 2 then the midpoint of bc is minus 2 comma 4 when you reduce this we get 2 Is it we get four? So the midpoint of M point is minus two comma four. By using A point is already given six comma two. Now M point is minus two comma four. We want to find this line's equation. The vertices through A, the midpoint, median, right? We want to find this equation, line's equation. Now one point and the M also one point, right? Two point form. by using two point form we know the formula y minus y1 divided by y2 minus y1 is equal to x minus x1 divided by x2 minus x1 that first point i take it as x1 y1 second point i take it as x2 y2 right now y minus y1 is equal to 2 divided by y2 is equal to 4 minus 2 is equal to right then x Minus x1 is equal to 6, x2 is equal to minus 2 minus 6, right? Now substitute this. Y minus 2 divided by 2 is equal to here x minus 6 divided by minus 8. I take this minus 8 to this side. We get minus 8 into it is in the denominator, right? It turns to numerator. Minus 8 into y minus 2 divided by 2 is equal to x minus 6. Here two ones are two fours are. Now minus four is multiple inside. We get minus four y minus into minus plus eight is equal to x minus six. Now we want to form the equation of the straight line. I take this four y plus eight to the another side. Here already we have x minus six. If you take this term to another side, we get plus four y minus eight equal to zero. That implies the equation is x plus four y. Minus six minus eight is equal to minus fourteen is equal to zero. Is the required equation of the median? Now we want to find the altitude of through A. Now we want to find this line's equation. See, now we have B and C. By using two point, we can able to find the slope. By using the B and C point, here we are finding the B point C. That is the point B and C is perpendicular to AD. This is the triangle, right? so now b and c by using the slope if the slope when two point is given slope of bc is equal to 
y2 minus y1 divided by x2 minus x1 is the formula. First point take it as x1 y1, second point x2 y2. Now in the place we are going to apply the value y2 is 9 minus y1 is also minus minus into minus plus 1 divided by x2 is 1. Here we have minus 5 minus into minus plus 5 is equal to 10 divided by 6 is nothing but 5 divided by 3. If we divide by 2 we get 5, divide by 2 we get 3. That is the slope of this is equal to 5 by 3. Here we know that the slope BC is perpendicular to AD. Let me take it as this is M1 means we know the formula perpendicular means M1 M2 is equal to minus 1. Then the second slope perpendicular slope is negative reciprocal. Let me substitute that in the place of M1 is 5 by 3 then M2 is equal to minus 1 then M2 is equal to I take this denominator to the numerator so here we have already have 3 so minus 1 into 3 is 3 divided by 5 this is the slope of the line AD right this is the slope of the line AD now we have one slope and we know the point of A now here we know one slope and a, a point is known to find the vertices of AD right so when point and slope is given means point slope form point slope form we know the formula of y minus y1 is equal to m of x minus x1 let me take it as x1 y1 right y minus y1 is equal to 2 is equal to m is minus 3 by 5 and then x minus x1 is 6 right I take this 5 to this side 5 into y minus 2 is equal to minus 3 into x minus 6 now multiply the term 5y minus 10 is equal to minus 3 into x is minus 3x minus into minus plus 18 here we have the negative symbol so I take this term to the left hand side so we get plus 3y minus 18 sorry 3x plus 3x minus 18 here already we have plus 5y minus 10 equal to 0 then 3x minus uh, right in the order x y z minus 3x plus 5y here 3x plus 5y here both are in the negative symbol so minus 28 equal to 0 is the required equation of the vertices through a altitude thank you students